How are you? What's going on, y'all? It's Young Stoney. Y'all already know who it is. I'm here with me, myself, and I. You already know we on Smooth TV. You know, I just came to the stoop, made three songs, you know, go crazy in the building, you know, um, and musically, you know, my musical career. You know, I'm just trying to go up with this shit. I'm just trying to influence, you know, I'm just trying to, I'm just trying to get a better life, you know what I'm saying? A lot of people been asking me, like, what, like, what made you get into music? And honestly, it's just like, I've always had the talent of freestyling. You know, I just, I've been through some shit. I lived through some crazy shit. I've seen some crazy shit, did some crazy shit. You know, we ain't gonna go too far into detail. But, you know, every time I step on a mic, it's kind of like, I'm venting, you know? It's therapy to me, you know? Like, that shit really help, you know? If you wanna do music, you know, fuck it, hit the stool, bro. Hop on the mic and vent. You feel me, vent some real shit. But like, there's gonna be, a lot of hate that come with that, you know what I mean? I got I got a lot of fake love, a lot of real hate. You know, I guess I get some backlashes, especially being a, a a white artist, you know, portraying against the shit, but you know, and of course cuz I got dreads too, you know, a lot of people be a lot of people be hating on me for that. But I'm just myself, I'm just being me, you know, I'm expressing myself, I'm expressing my problems, you know, my pain and my problems. And Honestly, like some advice to keep your head up. Just just keep going, man. Don't let anybody's word like break you. Don't let anybody's word knock you out. You know what I mean? Just be you. You know, be you. Stay confident. Confidence is key. Um, you know, a lot of my haters, they, they jack they my ops, they looking for me and shit. And it's like it's like I don't even got no ops no more, bro. Like that hood shit in the past, man, I'm trying to go up. I'm trying to get the fuck up out of here, bro. And it's like having all these little, little fans and shit. Having all these people, Jack, that they hate me for no reason. Don't even know them. Don't even, never met them, never seen them. Not from the same hood as me. It's like, at first, you know, it's like they just want a reaction from me. But once you stop giving that reaction, you know, they stop. You know, I see, like, a lot of people on the net that be hating on me, trying to climb me and shit. You know, and they they don't do nothing. They don't they, really, they don't they don't say nothing like that. They don't do that. But you know, that shit that just comes with the rap game. You know what I'm saying? But on you know, some real shit, you know, that's just a message to y'all. I just want to tell y'all keep your head up if you're in the rap game for real. Whether you a producer, engineer, uh, a rapper, whatever you is, you know, just keep your head up. Be yourself. Stay confident. And shit. But I'm kind of gonna switch the topic a little bit because. Shit. I just want to vent. I didn't mean like switching topics, but kind of. Kind of like because my last song I dropped was The Last Heartbreak. You know what I'm saying? Because I'm just doing bitches. You know what I mean? I'm not I'm not going to trip a bitch for real, for real. You know what I mean? But we've all been in love before. You know, we've all had our woman walk out on us before, do some dirty shit, go behind our back, type shit. You know, and it's, that's a different type of pain. Like, I felt, you know, I lost my brothers. You know, I've done seen some fucked up shit, like too much to be tripping a bitch, but it's just like once you get attached to a bitch, you know. So that's why I made that song Last Heartbreak. But <clears throat> I just need an explanation <clears throat> from a lot of y'all women out there. I ain't gonna say all women because I know some women that's really kept it down, kept it real loyal, but I just need an explanation on why y'all hoes. Y'all like and y'all call it doing you. You know, um and y'all know what I'm talking about. Y'all y'all probably sit behind the video like Oh, this boy, this boy, this white boy. Nah, like, why y'all doing that, man? Like, I'm trying to look for a woman that's like my mom. You know, treat me like my mom. You know, take care of me. You know, and, and my brother's the, my, like, quote from my brother, Savio done died a G, you feel me? He said, fuck 50-50, it's got to be 100 100 We both trying to elevate. There's going to be times where I need 100% of your help. There's going to be times where you need 100% of my help, but it's, it ain't, it ain't like that no more, you know, because y'all be hoeing and shit. <laughs> yeah, that's what I was trying to tell, bro, last night, but... You know what I'm saying? Like, like, I don't get it. They be hoeing. Half y'all got a baby daddy, you feel me? You got a kid with no father, you feel me? Y'all only, like, my age, like, 18, 19, 20, 21, and y'all going out clubbing with a kid at home and shit. Like, it's, it, I don't get that. This new generation crazy as hell. It's not only women too. I won't, I won't lie. It's, it's some men as well. You know that's doing some fuck shit out there. That's kind of ruining like reputation for men, females. 
just humans in general, cuz. Like, Facts like that trans shit. That's what I'm saying, that trans shit. Like, I keep, I keep it stacked. Like, I don't get I don't, that. This new generation really that. crazy as you know hell. It's not only women, too. I don't, I don't. Well, you live streaming, too. Yeah, we live on this bitch, too. If you if you on the live stream and you watching this, that's the real angle. We're not actually live. Oh, you're not actually. <laughs> I'm just streaming. <laughs> gangsta, gangsta, gangsta. But, say why, bro. And it's like. It's just a lot of problems nowadays, and it's like, I like, I just want to speak about it, even shit that I personally ain't going through. It just, like, I see it from, from the outside and the inside. I read between the lines, you know what I'm saying? So, I don't know. One thing I really just want to know is, like, and this is also talking about music-wise, too. It's like, why y'all why y'all got to point out that I'm a white boy rapping? Why y'all got to why y'all gotta come at me crazy because a, a white boy can't rap? You know what I'm saying? It's like... On the inside, we are human, you know. On the outside, we all present ourselves differently. Some of us white, some of us black, some of us, you know, tan, brown skin. It's like whatever someone is, it's what they are, bro. At the end of the day, we are human. You know, some of us come from the same shit. Some of us come from different shit. You know what I'm saying? But nowadays, it's like everybody like to make it about race. And I don't, I don't like that, you know what I mean? Me being one of the only white boys where I'm from, you know what I'm saying? It's like I see it, you know? And I understand that black people go through different struggles than white people, you know what I'm saying? But at the end of the day, it's like, you guys don't got to kind of rub it in our faces. You know what I'm saying? Like, it's just, it's just like, yeah, we go through shit too. You know what I mean? I'm white. I go through some shit. And I, I, shit. Like, I'm from the hood. I go through the same shit a lot of black people go through as well in this, in this, in this country. You know what I'm saying? And it's just like, I don't, I don't like how a lot of y'all kind of just pointed out by race. You know what I mean? It should be this person, this person. Men, female, that's it. Human. You know what I'm saying? Everybody equal at the end of the day. You know what I'm saying? Like, that's, that's great like that. On some real shit. But, on some real shit, I'm trying to, um... I'm about to do, I'm about to, uh, I'm just letting you know, I'm about to do, like, an insta live for, like, two, three minutes. Feel me? Just, you get on some, like, really, like, shit where niggas, like, just to look, damn, and they're already tuned in, listening. To the so comp, that, you feel yeah, me? Yeah, to the topic. I already talking about, yeah, actually, could, to continue that shit, I was saying before, I was talking about, um, what did it, I was talking about, like, how everybody make it, like, about race nowadays, and I'm like, what the fuck? Because, like, bro, look, like, y'all see my hair? I got dreadlocks in my head. A lot of people are like, oh, like, you can't get dreads with straight hair, yada, yada. Y'all shit's gonna fall out. Nah. Yeah, they say my hair dirty and shit. Nah, but what's going on, Instagram Live? Nah, dude, look at my hair. My shit clean, no build up. I don't got none of that. You feel me? Like, I just, it's just locks, bro. The same way, you feel me? Same way other people get locks. I get locks too. A lot of people be hating on me for my hairstyle too. What's going on, y'all? How y'all, how y'all doing, man? But yeah, a lot of people be hating. Just for the hair, just for a hairstyle, cuz. You feel me? And there's a meaning behind this. I ain't get dreads just cause I want dreads. I got this shit. You feel me? Cause there's reason behind it. I ain't gonna go too deep into it, but like, I'm trying to get up out that, that street life. I'm trying to connect with nature. I'm trying to build myself for the better. I'm trying to do a lot. I'm trying to do a lot. You know what I'm saying? I'm trying to better myself, become a better human in general. You know what I'm saying? And honestly, this how this how our hair is supposed to naturally be. I went from free form to traditional, but you know what I'm saying? At the end of the day, hair, washed hair, clean hair, just lock up. I just want to get that out to people because I've been seeing a lot of y'all come on my TikTok going crazy. And it's like, why y'all come crazy at me for? Like, <laughs> I ain't do shit, man. I ain't do nothing. This, shit, God, this is my hair, man. It's natural, man. This how it's supposed to be. You know what I'm saying? What's going on, Instagram Live? I'm trying to see if there are any names in here that I recognize. Tight, tight. Nah, but as a thing, though, cause like, just because of my hair, a lot of new people seeing me start hating on me, getting back. And I was ready for it. I knew people would get backlash on it because, you know what I'm saying? But at the end of the day, it's a protected hairstyle. It helps my hair grow, you know? So, shit, I got to stop judging a book by its cover. And that's some real shit. I gotta stop judging on both eyes cover. And that's that's a message for real, for real. Like, I know a lot of motherfuckers that are capable of some shit that you wouldn't even know they're capable of. You know what I'm saying? Like, Blizz said, LOL, can I get an interview? Can I get an interview? Yeah, gang. Hey, drop, drop a topic in the comments, man. I'll start speaking on it, man. I speak the real, man. It's too real over here. Show them the Say line. what up, Blizz. Yeah, sit it up. We on camera, man. And it's going up on Smooth TV. If it ain't mixed by Smooth, I don't want to hear that shit. You feel me? 
Hey, gotta be mixed by smooth man. Smooth TV tune in, man. We got keep me on tune with everybody type shit. But mm. he probably don't want to disrupt you. You don't yeah. want to fuck up what you doing. He probably yeah, no, that's cool. Though. He respect it. That's why he do it because he would join in a heartbeat. Hell yeah, nah, but I met him at a Nork party. Oh, that's what's up. Yeah. Nah, Nork be cussing on no bullshit. Like I know them functions out there used to be like like not even used to be. They be jumping now. Like in, in Asbury, y'all like way back way back in the day, man. Like it used to get lit, but then everybody would do some bullshit. Like you know what I mean? Cause everybody know there's two sides of Asbury. You know what I'm saying? We from the West. You know what I'm saying? And all the functions down there back in the old day, you know, shit would go down, shit get shot, type shit. And then, like, we was beefing with people from Newark, too. So it's like, you know, more people from different hoods would come through, try to start some shit. You know, and shit would get out of hand. So it's like, people don't even get lit down there no more. A bunch of cases going on, but the people getting kicked out. They, they building, they knocking down old projects, they building new ones. And it's like, what the fuck, man? Like, the world changing. They trying to gentrify this shit. The last new apartments they built in Asbury, they look beautiful, but they, they turned to Section 8. They turned to projects. They ganged out already, you know what I'm saying? I ain't going to say too much because that's federal, but, oh, no, but on some real shit, like, that shit just crazy. I love how Newark still jumping, though, you know, because it's like one hood to another. It's like it's the same shit, you know what I'm saying? But they still, they don't give a fuck. They still be throwing them parties. After it got to the point where, like, all the blocks was getting shut down and shit and Asbury from all these shootings and shit, it's like, they, they, they still going to Newark. A block will be shut down. They have people park around the corner and shit. And niggas walking and shit. So it's like, I, I don't know. I feel like, I feel like, bro, I got I to gotta crack out to Newark more. You feel me? I got some homies up north. I got to show some love, too. You feel me? God, you know, shout, shout out my peoples in, in the EO, man. East Orange. You know what it is. Why, why? We'll close it out. Boy, we closing out the video. Yeah. Yeah, but hey, this is just honestly me venting to y'all, just speaking real, you know. Again, it's a smooth TV. Thank you to our 100 viewers we'll probably get. Right, right. Hey, we going to start somewhere for the 100 loyal fans out there. You know, it's all love, man. This was Young Stoney on Smooth TV. If it ain't mixed by Smooth, I don't want to hear that shit. And yeah, and tune in. Follow me on Instagram, all platforms, all social media. Young Stoney at Y-X-N-G-S-T-O-N-E-Y. And y'all already know, tune in.